What is a next generation firewall? Is there something new we should be looking at with security? You might hear about application control, but let's be clear, the ability of a firewall to control applications is not new. The concept of a firewall understanding the application has actually been on the market as far back as 2003. So what is new? Back in 2003, most applications were well-defined, well-known, and static. We could update them with a patch or release as needed. But the agile nature of web technologies bring powerful applications to many devices at blistering speeds. Sites and applications are being released and adopted by users at a furious rate. They need to stay constantly updated to be effective. But this is just a feature. What you need to be thinking about is next generation policy management. So what is next generation policy management? Consider how you manage your policy today. Access rules built on simply IPs and ports. And that is going to be a challenge moving forward. Users no longer belong to specific networks. And they are using more devices than ever. Your next generation policy needs to be about people and the devices. And as for the applications we use, is it a website? Is it an application? Is it both? A next generation policy will give unified control for applications and sites. Managing apps and websites should not be two separate jobs. By automatically updating application policy dynamically from the cloud, as well as removing compromised websites. The next generation policy will also give you visibility to manage your network, as well as understand what users and applications are most active in your network. By adding the dimensions of people along with the visibility into applications, you're almost there with a the next generation policy. But I'm afraid there's still something we're not considering here. Can you see what our next generation policy is missing? You know, the very thing you're actually trying to secure? It's not enough to know about users, devices, and applications. You have to know what data the applications are accessing in a next generation policy and where exactly that data goes. Take this Air Canada iPhone app, for example. It allows check-in for flights. This app is so concerned with user privacy to sending check-in information clear text across the internet. The main webpage for Air Canada uses SSL. We might assume the app used it as well. The point is that TLP can be used to show a risk that an application presents to user data. And by involving users in the data loss prevention process, you don't have to interrupt the flow of activity. In fact, you can learn from the user how to shape their policy for real-world usage in real time. Next generation policy management is not about specific features. It's about bringing those features together for better visibility into security risk. It's about defining access for people, not IPs. Applications, not ports. And don't forget the most important part. It's also about understanding where your data is going, who is using it, and getting real feedback from the users about it. Don't just settle for a next generation feature. Build, grow, and manage your next generation security policy.